Good afternoon, everybody. Today, we're gonna react to Nipsey Hussle, Last Time I Checked, featuring YZ. This was a song that's been uh, requested a few times. YG. And so, uh, yeah, we're gonna check it out. Last time that I checked, it was five chains on my neck. It was no smut on my rep. Last time that I checked, I was selling zones in the set. Make a quarter mil, no sweat. Last time that I checked, I'm the streets voice out west. Legendary self made progress. Last time that I checked, first you get the money, then respect, then the power and the hoes come next. Last time that I checked, I've been self made from the dribble. I was been saying I'm a killer. Nah. Playing no games with you niggas, pop cut, switch lanes on you niggas. Nah. I laid down the game for you niggas, taught you how to charge more than what they pay for you niggas. That's pretty, like he's talking about how he's basically trying to teach a way to do it self-made. Yeah. You know, not not just signing a, a deal just to get the money. instant money. Money, yeah, to do it for yourself and get what you're actually worth. Huh, that is a, I didn't even catch that. Yeah. Well done, Brad. Thanks, man. Appreciate yeah. that. You're welcome. On the whole thing for you niggas, reinvest, double up, then explain for you niggas, it gotta be love. Run the city, it gotta be cut. For the pieces, I took off the Monopoly board. Hey, y'all niggas, cross claims, it gotta be fraud. Just keep the hood about your mouth, and you gotta be charged. I doubled up, tripled up, nigga, what? Banged on the whole game, I ain't give a fuck. Nobody tripping, had no business, got my digits up. And when I drop, you know I'm about to flash. Last time that I checked, checked, it was five chains on my neck. It was no smut on my rep last time that I checked. I really like this beat. Yeah, the beat is good. Yeah, I'm a big fan. I, I actually, so far, the last song, I can't remember what we reacted to, what it was, what it was called. Anyways, the first Nipsey Hussle song, I actually like this song better, I think, so far. No, definitely. And I think that, like, instantly, when a song goes towards, like, money, cars, that type of thing, like instantly, I'm just kind of like, ah, uh, like yeah. you know what I mean. Yeah. But like, the more I listen to him, the more like, he's not just like, like I think we talked about it in the last video, but yeah. like he he goes into depth more about it. Like you can tell, like he just, you know what I mean, talking yeah. about like reinvest, and then I explained it to you. You yeah. know what I mean, that kind of thing. It's like there's more to it than just money and cars. You know what right. I mean? Like he's like, yeah, I'm wealthy, I'm successful, but like. A little bit about like here's how I did it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah, it's not just you know I got a big fat check and I wouldn't. It's not just I made a rap video, and then blew all the money on cars and yeah. In, you know what I mean? I like, bought them when I could afford them and reinvested and yeah. this and it's just like yeah. So I'm, lo I'm learning yeah. to like it more and more. Yeah. Selling zones in the set, make a quarter mil, no sweat. Last time that I checked, I'm the streets voice out west. Legendary self made progress. Last time that I checked, first you get the money, then respect, then the power in the halls come next. Last time that I checked, come through fly, no cosign. I ain't need radio to do mine. I done fine, and I take my time and take my tribe. Every level that I crossed in this game, like state lines, it was visionary. Honestly, I think he he seems like the gangster, like city version of Upchurch kind of in the sense that he's always just talking about like I did all on my own independent yeah you know like no I get what you're, yeah it's like the, it's like the polar opposite as far as like background and background where and where you're from but you know they're kind of spitting different lines I mean because Upchurch talks about cars and stuff all the time too yeah but they're cars like that we like like trucks and you know Mustangs yeah. and Corvettes and stuff like that <laughs> Yes, Cody. Either I'm genius or you niggas scary. Maybe it's both in this balance I deliver daily. For every nigga in these streets trying to feed the babies. The single mama's working hard not to miss a payment. And dirty money get washed on royalty statements. Black owners in this game are powerful races. Young niggas in the set just doing it makeshift. I think a ride is how you end up in charge. It's how you end up in penthouses, end up in cars. It's how you start off a curb server, end up in bars. It's how you win the whole thing and lift up a cigar with sweat dripping down your face. Cause the mission was so hard and I check, check. It was five chains on my neck. It was no smart. He's talking about working hard. Like, yeah. And just not, not putting yourself in situations that you're going to do something stupid, you know? Well, I know he talked about, like, dirty money. It sounded yeah. like he was, like... No, apparently what a lot of people, people are saying is he did he made some really big mistakes. I don't know what big mistakes is, 
a big when he was a young person and he yeah. turned his life around and so i think his whole mission and in, and in, in what he was trying to do was show people that they can do the same thing as him yeah especially from where he came from i don't quite know where that is and what those what, what happened but i think that's what his whole you know idea was yeah it just sounds like he's talking down on like the drug dealing yeah and that like obviously he didn't say that but that's yeah. kind of what it sounds like with dirty yeah. money like and, and i think he's talking on like with like the single mothers and the people trying to provide for their kids like sometimes like in certain areas and certain you know like that is the easy way to like get by yeah. you know what i mean like not necessarily easy but the yeah. quickest way to make the most money yeah. to get by that they know of you know and so on my rep, last time that I checked, I was selling zones in the set, make a quarter mil, no sweat, last time that I checked, I'm the streets voice out west, legendary self-made progress, last time that I checked, first you get the money, then respect, then the power and the hoes come next, last time that I checked, I got the front and the back, we on the way and that's a fact, this real, this ain't rap, where everybody wanna act pro-black, the last lie you heard, is say that, this, that, I did, made it out the gutter shit, Nip told you fuck the middle man, I told you fuck a bitch, fuck wearing they clothes, that went my own shit, y'all got on your label, I on my own, bitch, hey man, I remember all that game you thought me, don't fuck around and get played by the label owners, talk that shit. I love that line, like, not wearing their stuff, I wear my own stuff. Yeah. Like creating your own brand like that's one thing a lot of people don't realize is when you're you know an, a, an artist like you're your brand yeah and it's just like with you know owning a company or whatever it is you're branding that company right when you're an artist or you're a, you know a, a, a photographer whatever it is you're branding yourself and, yeah and it's like a lot of people you know successful people their brand is a lot bigger than just their one Thing that they're doing. They're one talent. They're yeah. one talent, you know. To these niggas, Adrian Broner, but secure the window, don't let that game go. Cause when it's game over, it's when the game over. And all they do is play the game till it's game over. And you be giving game like a big brother, mission never let them take it from us. Last time that I checked, it was five chains on my neck. It was no smut on my rep. Last time that I checked, I was selling zones in the set. Make a quarter mil, no sweat. Last time that I checked. I'm the streets voice out west, legendary self-made progress, last time that I checked. First you get the money, then respect, then the power in the hoes come next, last time that I checked. That one way better than the other one. Yeah, I, I really <laughs> like that song a lot. I really like that video too. I thought the video was really good as well. Um, but no, it's like you're getting. I feel like I'm as I'm starting to listen to more of his music. I'm starting to learn more about what he was about as a person, and it's cool to see. Like, again, he's from a culture that we don't really know. Yeah. But it's cool to see just that you know. Like I said in the first one, the business aspect of it, he just he came from nothing and and came what he was. Yeah, no, it's it's cool that it's like the like it's rap about money, cars, and stuff like that. Yeah. Like I said, it instantly kind of turns me off to right. songs most of the time. But like the more you listen to him, the more you hear that like yeah, obviously that stuff's important to him. And he raps about it, but yeah. it's like it's that with a message. You yeah. know what I mean? And it's like that's cool. And like yeah. trying to you know. Trying to show people that there's another way to get, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment below. Let us know what your favorite Nipsey song is. And, and buy a t-shirt. <laughs> apparently we're coming out with t-shirts. Apparently Cody's doing something we don't know about. Alright, we'll see you guys <laughs> next time.